my diamonds so today I'm coming to you with a special video every Monday I want to do a money saving Monday so every Monday I'm gonna show you some things that I found at my local drugstore which is what I do most of my um, um, coupon and that is CVS Walgreens Walmart um, or sometimes I go to stores too. If it's something that they have on like a good sale, I go to some stores. But every Monday, I'm going to bring you a money-saving video showing you what I save money on. So today, it was all about CVS. CVS had some great deals today. Um, it was, I got free makeup. Now, who loves free makeup? I know I love free makeup. So I got some free makeup. I got some, everything was free. The whole transaction was free. Um, and I'll break it down to you and let you know how you can do it and how it all became free. But um, Mondays, I'm going to do like a, um, I got to get that off, keep bothering me. On Mondays, I got to do a, a session on money saving money. So make sure you tune in every Monday, my diamonds, to see what I save money on. Then you can go out and do it too. So today is all about makeup. So cover girl makeup. Well, we're going to start with this. CVS is a drugstore. I don't know if it's in every state, but I know it's in the state of Illinois. I live in the state of Illinois. Um, so CVS Pharmacy. Oh, I'm having cake up. I hate when my lip gloss cake up. Okay. So CVS Pharmacy has is a great place to start couponing. Um, you have to download the app, which if you have a um, if you have a iPhone. The app looked like this. Let me show you. So if you have an iPhone, the app looks like this. Oh, hold on, I went into the app. Hold on. So if you have an iPhone, the iPhone app looks like this. Let's see if you can zoom in on it. I don't know if you can see that or not, but that's how the app looks. It's, it says CVS Pharmacy on the app. So first thing you need to do when you're couponing at CVS is to download the app. So once you download the app, you they ask you for an email address. They're going to ask you for a number. Um, when you go in the store, you scan the app. They have this thing called the Coupon Center. You go in every Sunday. I usually go in on Sunday because that's when the deals restart at CVS. So when you go in on Sunday... You scan your app with your card. Your card is connected to your app. So you scan it at the CVS Coupon Center. And once you scan it, a whole bunch of coupons are going to print out based on what you like. Now, in the beginning, you might not get them that many coupons. You're only going to get about two, maybe three coupons in the beginning. But as you start slowly shopping more and more at CVS, they're going to start sending you coupons based on your purchases. So for me, I usually buy a lot of makeup. I usually buy a lot of body wash. Sometimes I buy diapers for people in the family. I usually buy stuff like that. So most of my coupons are based on some most of the things that I coupon for or that I shop for at CVS. So yesterday um, was a makeup day, good makeup sales. And for example, CoverGirl, all my CoverGirl makeup was free. So I'm gonna show you. So 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 to reiterate, you download the app. When you go into the CVS, you scan your card that's connected to the app, and then all your coupons are going to uh, print out for you on Sunday. And then based on the coupons you got, you can also match those up with manufactured coupons also. So I'm just going to show you what I got from CVS um, this week. Again, it was a good week for CoverGirl. So these are um, the items I got. CoverGirl was... Let me see if I can bring up the app so I can um, bring up the newspaper so I can show you what it is. Um, the cover girl was um, spin. I'm coming to bring up the weekly ad so you can see. So every week, you need to be getting either a sales paper because the sales papers is what has the manufactured coupons in it. So every week, you I usually buy my um, newspapers from Menards. They're only $1.50 at Menards, and I can buy them on Saturday. So our, our paper, Sunday papers are available at Menards on Saturday. So Saturday I go and I used to get, if it's a good week, I'll get six papers. If it's a slow week, I'll get four. If it's a real slow week where it's only one insert, like this past week it was only one insert, I didn't even bother to go and get them. 
Um, also, an alternative, if you don't want to go out and purchase newspapers, is also printing them off the internet. This uh, website called coupons.com. Um, once you go onto the website, when you sign up, you're going to be able to print coupons every week or every day if you want um, online. So you just print them out. You got to have a printer and you just go through there and you select the coupons that you want. So if you don't want to go and get newspaper, I recommend you download the app coupons.com and then that way you can also just go on there and you can print the coupons. Okay, so this is the um, CVS ad for today. Mm, let me see. Can you see that? There you go. So usually the day before, maybe Saturday night or a couple days, it shows you what is going to be on sale at CVS. So on Sunday or Monday, you need to be planning out your deals. Let's see if that focus for you. So when you go on this app, you kind of look scrolling through. And then that's the cover girl. Let me see if that's the cover girl. Um, so this is the cover girl. Um, deal at CVS this week. Now, CVS bucks, or that's what they're called. CVS um, reward bucks. That's what they're called. Now, when it says get eight dollars on an extra care bucks, that means that if you spend, I think this was spend twelve. Let me see if I can blow it up for you to see it. There you go. So spend 12, get... Oh. So spend 12, get $8. So what that means, if you go into CVS and you buy at least $12 worth of CoverGirl products, they're going to give you $8 back to spend on anything else in CVS. So, for example, I took my $12. I found $12 worth of CoverGirl makeup. I spent my $12. They're going to give me $8 back. What if I'm out of eggs, milk, bread? I take that $8 and I go and buy me some milk, eggs, and bread with that $8. So, in, in essence, you took $12 and you bought makeup, you bought your egg, you bought your milk, and you bought your bread, all for $12. So, it's a it's a win-win situation. So, CVS is the best place to go to for makeup, any, any um, groceries. Now, it's going to be a little high because it's a drugstore, so groceries aren't going to be cheap like Walmart or food for less or any of those stores it's going to be a little bit more expensive but you got eight dollars towards it you spent you went in the store with 12 you spent your 12 dollars they gave you back eight dollars and now you went and bought you some milk eggs cheese whatever you need with that eight dollars so in essence you only went into cvs with 12 dollars and you got makeup again you got anything else you need so cvs is a great place to coupon so this week the cover girl again was spent 12 get eight dollars so i want to show you what i got um now i didn't really have that many extra bucks i only had like three extra bucks left because i spent a lot um the, the week before on items so this week i only had three dollars to work with now when you already have extra bucks you can apply it towards whatever purchase that you're gonna have long as they're not expired so let me show you some of the things i got um the cover girl things that i got so I got these um, um, eyebrow pencils. They come with like a little sharpener. So I got these eyebrow pencils in brown. Was it rich brown? Yeah, rich brown. I got this CoverGirl eyeshadow. It comes with four of them. Maybe I should have took this off. But I don't want to mess up my nails. So I can open it though. I'll open it so you can see. So I bought this uh, CoverGirl eyeshadow. And it's more like a natural nude colors. 
Usually when I wear eyeshadow, I like the nude colors. I don't know. I'm not really into like colors like red, blue, purple. It looks pretty on some people, but I try to stay natural because my face really isn't like a strong face to say. So if I put strong things on my face, my face is going to look strong. So I don't. I want to always look natural. So that's why I really don't wear that much makeup, you know. But these are uh, the four eyeshadows that I got. I love lip gloss. So this is a pretty lip gloss. I don't know. Let me see. It's the uh, Cover Girl. And the name of it is... I don't know. I don't have a name. Oh, yes, it does. New York, New York. Oh, where is that it? Hmm. Maybe it don't have a name. I don't know. I mean, Cover Girl is in New York. I don't see a name on here. Oh, I'm sorry. It is a name on here. Oh, uh, let's see. What is 630? And it's called Give Me Guava. Give Me Guava. So this is the color I got. And it's like a pretty pink, I want to say. Peach gold. If you can see that. Like a peach gold. So I got a lip gloss. And the last thing I got from CoverGirl is this real pretty lipstick, continuous color lipstick, and it's Sugar Almond, number 10. So if you can see that. So those are the four things I got from, for my $12, get $8 off deal. So I got these four things. Now my coupon that I got was a 5 out of 20. Again, they send you coupons every week based on your purchases. So they sent me a 5 out of 20. I also received a 4 out of 15. And then I also had coupons to match each one of these items. So I had a coupon, a manufactured coupon for here for this one. It was off any um any CoverGirl product. So it was $2 off for this. This one was also $2 off for this. Then I had one for $2 off any lip product. So lipstick that made $2 off for that. And then $2 off of that. So again, CVS and you coupons. And you can also pair them with manufactured coupons that you print off coupons.com. Or either you uh, get them off the newspaper. So uh, after that, let me see. I'm going to show you my receipt. So this is my receipt. So on the receipt, you can see all four items, the price of the items. And then you can see where my coupons came off at. So these are the four items that rang up. These are the prices, $7.99, $6.29, $5.99, $4.69. And then once they ring them up, make sure again you meet at least twelve dollars. Me, I had to meet at least twenty because um, I had a five out twenty. So of course I'm trying to get this twenty dollars so I can get my five out twenty. Then after that, they scan your coupon. So this was a four dollar off coupon that I had. This was a two dollar off coupon, a two dollar off coupon, and I had another four dollar off coupon. So she scans all my coupons that I have. You have to make sure they match the products. Make sure if you're buying a lip gloss, you have a lip gloss product, I mean coupon. So make sure everything matches up. And then from there, she scanned my CVS bucks, which I had three. So I had a $2 off, I had a $1 off, and then I had um, the five off 20. So once all that came off, my total was $4.96. Four dollars and ninety-six cents. Tax in Illinois is high as hell. So the tax by itself was two dollars and fifty cents. That doesn't come off. In CVS, I mean in Illinois, you have to pay tax. Whether you have coupons or not, you're still gonna get charged tax. So my tax on that was two dollars and fifty cents. My total was four dollars seven dollars and forty six cents. I paid in twenty dollars in cash, and that's my change. But 
I got back an eight dollar extra one. So all these CoverGirl items that I showed you were free because I paid four ninety six in cash, but CVS gave me an eight dollar extra buck back. So now that actually was a three dollar and four cent money maker. If you want to look at it like that, I made money on this on this deal. That's when people say it's a money maker. That's what they mean. They mean like I got back more than I gave out. So. I gave them $4.96 and they gave me an $8 coupon to use. So in actuality, if I needed milk, bread, butter, any of that stuff, I could have really walked in there with $5, did my transaction, got back $8. So now I suddenly have to find, I mean, shop with $5, now I got $8 to shop with. So that's what they mean by money making. And so our, all my CoverGirl products were free which who doesn't like free makeup so that's a way you can coupon at cvs um so every sunday like i said the deal start over with start going on coupons.com printing your makeup coupons you know if you can get newspapers get a couple newspapers you know usually if you watch cvs i mean watch youtube um couponers the big couponers the ones that coupon like at all the stores you know i coupon at all of them but i'm not like a regularly couponing like i'm doing other stuff too but when I do, I usually go on here and I watch and see what deals they did. And then from there, I decide what I want to do. So someone did it, found a good um, household deals. You know, I watch what they did and I go out and listen. If you go to YouTube, you can watch what they did too. But I'm just showing you how to get how I got my free makeup today. My free cover girl makeup. Now, I took that $8. I didn't need bread, milk, butter, all that stuff. We, I already have it in my refrigerator. So I took the $8 and I bought a whole nother purchase with my $8. So now I got $8 and CVS extra bucks. So with my $8, I went and bought, um, let's see, I bought a Revlon lip balm. I like this lip balm. It makes your lips soft. I like this. I like a lip balm. I love lip glosses and lip balm. So I bought, uh, what is this, Revlon Kiss Me? Kiss Me Revlon. It's a peach color. Uh, let me see. Juicy Peach. How about this? Uh -huh. Soft Soap Body Wash. I like this smell. Heavenly Vanilla. It smells really good. Let me smell it. Ooh, it smells good. And I really don't like vanilla smell, but this smells really good. So I bought this Soft Soap. I bought another soft soap. Now, these soft soap was on sale two for seven. And you get a, let me see, two for seven. And then you get a, you get some kind of, I think I want to say a $4 extra buck back. Let me make sure. Oh, maybe it's on my receipt. Yeah. So these, these soft soap was two for seven. And they gave you back a four dollar. Yeah, they gave you back a four dollar extra care buck. So you buy two of them, they two for seven, they gave you back four dollars. So in essence, they were one fifty a piece. So I bought two of these. Um, the CVS brand body wash was buy one get one free. So this one was one ninety nine. This one was a dollar. So both of them together was three dollars. Buy one get one free. And I'll show you why I got these in a minute. I bought some Colgate. I like Colgate. Colgate Max Fresh um, Knockout. It's a new. It's a new scent or a new kind. I never had this kind, so when I seen it, I wanted to try it. So the Colgate Max Fresh. And then I bought. Oh, I'm missing something. I bought um, this Rimmel Scandalous Eyes. I like this mascara. You know, this is one of my favorite mascaras. So Rimmel was spend ten. Let me see. Rimmel was spend ten get five dollar extra care bucks back. So I got one. The other one, I think I left it in the car. I don't see the other one for some reason. I don't see the other one. But I bought two of them. I bought two of them. 
All right, so again, this is my second transaction. I had $8. So I started this transaction with an $8 credit, if you want to look at it like that. So the two body washes uh, were two for seven. The Remo Kiss was $4.99. The Scandalous Eyes, they were $6.99 a piece. And the Colgate, Colgate Max Fresh was $3.59. So this was everything that I bought. That total seems high, because when she bring it all up, I was at like $28. Now my man almost fell out, like, oh Lord, I can't pay $28, honey. So it was $28. And then after she scanned all my things, I had a couple of coupons um, on my, uh, actually for this one, I didn't have any coupons. I had all manufactured coupons. So let's see, what did I have? So in the newspaper, a couple papers back, I had Remo had a coupon was about um, a dollar off any of their products. So those two dollar coupons, that was from Remo. So they took a dollar off each mascara. That four dollar coupon that I had, that was for oh, what was that four dollar coupon for? Oh, the four dollar coupon. Yeah, what was that four dollar coupon for? Uh, I don't know what that four dollar coupon was for. But anyway, I got a that was my eight dollar. I had a four dollar coupon. I guess I missed something. I don't know why I got that four dollar coupon for. I don't know. If she rang four dollars up twice. Cause I didn't have a four dollar coupon. Oh, I had a four dollar off. Right, I had a four dollar off Revlon, which came off there. It adjusted to three seventy. I had an eight dollar extra buck. Um, now I have my coupon my when it, it says these all these coupons down here is the coupons that I had that came out the coupon machine So again, they give me coupons based on what I purchased from CVS. So my first coupon was a 3 off 10 body wash My second coupon was a 2 off 8 body wash. So right there. I had to spend at least $10 to get what? $7 off I had to spend $10 to get five dollars off so it was three off ten and two off eight so i had to spend ten dollars to get five dollars off so that's why i bought the two for seven soft soap and then these right here brought my total up to ten dollars because there were two for three dollars 199 by one get one free so that made my body wash total come to ten so if i spent ten dollars they took five dollars off so basically all those body washes was only five dollars i had a $4 off Revlon, so this was $4.99, and I had a $4 off coupon, so that makes this $0.99. Cent. Then I had um, a 2 off $8 Rimmel, so it took $2 off those two mascaras, and then I had a dollar a piece coupon for them, so it took a total of $3 off those two mascaras. Then I had that Colgate. That Colgate was $1.50 off. It was $3.99, I think. Uh, the Colgate was $3.59. It took $1.50 off, and then it took off another $0.99. Cent. So the Colgate ended up being $0.50, cent, $2.50, $3.50, or dollar. The Colgate ended up being a dollar. So after she rang me up, she rang up all my coupons. I had eight items. My total came out to be three dollars and eighty-five cents for all that stuff I just showed you. Three eighty-five. Three eighty-five. Tax again is high as hell in Illinois, so it was two dollars and sixty cents. Two dollars and sixty cents for the tax. And then that my total was six dollars and forty-five cents. I paid with six dollars and fifty cents. My change was a nickel. Now this transaction gave me back. I'm going to show you what it gave me back because after that, I stopped spending them. Uh, it gave me back $9 in extra bucks. So I spent $3.85 out of pocket plus tax. I spent the total of $6.45, but I got back $9 in extra bucks. So that means that this was free. And plus a, I mean, if you want to count the tax it was a six seven eight 
it was a two dollars and fifty cent money maker if you want to count the tax without the tax it was a six seven eight nine it was a five dollars and fifteen cent money maker if you want to cat count it without the tax so i only paid 385 out of po top pocket without tax so in illinois tax is high so i paid 385 out of pocket and then they gave me back a nine dollar extra buck so the whole transaction was free all this body wash and this is all i got for free so i got this is my second transaction i got these two body washes i got these two soft soaps and then i got my mascara that I like, my lip balm that I like, and my, I don't know how this is, toothpaste, but I'm going to try it and let y'all know how it is. So it's a toothpaste. So that was all free. Now, once you get your extra buck next week, when the deals come along, you're going to be starting with a $9 extra buck. Now, remind you. You only, I only went into CVS spending, I mean, if you want to calculate it, I only really spent a total of four ninety. well, I spent $7.46 plus $6.45, I spent 12 I spent $13 out of pocket. I got back a total of a $9 extra buck plus an $8 extra buck. So I got a $17 back in extra bucks total, but I only went in there spending $13. So in reality, this is like a what, $6 money maker, including tax. So everything was pretty much free. And next week, I'm starting off the week with a $9 extra buck. So this is the best week to go couponing. Again, everything was free, makeup, makeup is hot as heck heck so if you can get makeup for free you winning 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 makeup is hot i would have spent out of pocket how much would i would have spent on this makeup i would have spent on the cover girl alone i would have spent like 25 dollars let me see eight I would have spent over $20 on those little things I just showed you. That little cover girl makeup. I would have spent over $20 on this stuff. That's not even with tax. So with tax, I would have spent on these little four items. Well, let me, this ain't rubber on. With this cover girl makeup, I would have spent over $20 for these little four items. And I got it for free. Because again, I earned $8 in extra bucks. I rolled them into my next transaction. And then I left the store at least with $9 in extra bucks for me to use next week. So this week is the best week to go couponing at CVS. Free makeup. Free body wash. Free toothpaste. And you can't go wrong. So in this world, you have to make sure that you're spending less money that you, than you have to spend. Don't spend a lot of money, you know. You can get it for cheap. I'm sorry, this eyelash is bothering me. If you can get it for cheap, then, you know, by all means, get it for cheap. And the only way you're going to get it for cheap is by coupon. Because the manufacturers, they give you coupons to use on new products that they have coming out or products that might not be moving as fast or you know maybe something that's you know popular and they they just want to treat their customers to something so they know like if this lash um mascara is a good selling one they'll put out a coupon for it you know kind of to compensate you give you a little discount on something that you like so every every monday i'm going to be coming to you with money saving tips um Again, this week was how to save money on makeup. Um, next week is going to be something else. I'm not sure what it's going to be next week. You know, it might be household next week. This week was makeup. So, again, make sure you download your CVS app. Um, make sure you start clipping your coupons from the newspaper. Go to coupons.com and start printing them. And then plan for your next week. This paper, CVS paper, comes out like Thursday or Friday. So, if you got the app, you'll be able to see what deals are going to be ready for Sunday. 
If you uh, if it don't come in your app that soon, you can get on YouTube. They start doing their CVS deals like Monday and Tuesday. They start planning for Sunday. So if you get on here and you just follow some YouTube people, that coupon at CVS, they start downloading their things on like Monday or Tuesday. So you'll be able to see what is available. Again, next week I'll be back. I don't know if I'm going to CVS or where I'm going. I might go to Walgreens next week because I keep on at CVS. I keep on at Walgreens. I keep on at Target. I keep on at Walmart. I keep on at Food for Less. I keep on at all those stores. So um, I, I just try to save money anywhere I can. So I just want to bring some of the savings to you um, as far as like beauty items. You know, I really don't wear like foundation and all that stuff on my face. Um, but if I see something that a lot of people are wearing, I'll, I'll coupon it and I'll bring it and tell you, well, hey, they got this on sale at this store. Here's a coupon. Go and get you some. You know, because I know a lot of YouTubers wear makeup or people that, that watch might wear, wear makeup. I just don't. Okay, so this is the end of Money Making Monday. I don't have a story time today. Tomorrow I'll come back with my story time. But... Today, I just want to show you how to save money. It's what it's all about is saving money in this world. Don't just go out there and spend $30 and $40 on drugstore makeup when you can just coupon it for free. Okay? So, I'm going to end this um, YouTube. Make sure you subscribe. I need subscribers. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Smash, smash. Smash that button and subscribe to my channel, Nobby Beauty. Please subscribe. I need subscribers. I like y'all diamonds. Where y'all at? I need some subscribers. So subscribe to my channel. Um, if you subscribe to my channel, you'll receive a promo code to get ten dollars off um, to use on our website, NobbyHair.com. So if you subscribe, you'll get a ten dollar uh, a promo code also. So subscribe to our channel. Follow us on Instagram, Nobby Beauty or NobbyHair.com. I mean, Nobby Hair, at Nobby Hair or at Nobby Beauty. So follow us on Instagram and like our Instagram, like our Facebook page, Nobby Hair. Like our Nobby Hair uh, Facebook page. Um, the Facebook page for Nobby Beauty isn't quite ready yet, but it's coming. It'll be ready soon. So go ahead and subscribe here and then follow us on instagram and like my facebook page please all right so i'm leaving you all diamonds i'll be back tomorrow though don't cry i'll be back tomorrow for you and whatever you do make sure you shine like a diamond thank you and you all have a great night bye